going on guys? I am sitting in my home office. I'm super excited to finally be in my new home. I got all this stuff to set up in the home office. Wanted to show you guys the process, show you guys kind of where I work when I do my YouTube stuff. So we're gonna set up all the stuff that's behind me. Go ahead and show you guys the house after that. Then we'll wait till nighttime to check these things out at night. You guys can see I got some lights and some different things beside me. It's gonna look super dope in here. So let's start with this big 34 inch curved monitor. It's gonna kind of be the first thing that we put down, one of the biggest things, and then we'll kind of build up around that. screen is set up. I'm going to throw out, I got a mouse pad, a keyboard, and a mouse. Go ahead and throw those out. We'll have our desktop kind of set up. Check that out, guys. And I believe it's going to be a little bit colorful. Got the RGB lights behind it, so super dope. matching mouse to go with it. Okay, so all that stuff is running to my new MacBook. And if you guys don't know, the new MacBooks only have USB-C. So we got a hub here that's gonna connect the HDMI going to the TV or the monitor also the keyboard and the mouse all in one. And I can also throw my SD card for YouTube in here, whatever I want, my microphone I can plug into here. So I'll have one cord to plug into my laptop when I set it down and everything will be connected over here. So I got some Govi. Govi brand is a super dope lighting brand. You guys have heard of Philips probably, but Govi makes some smart lights and some TV lights. I got some lights downstairs I'll show you guys later. We're gonna put these around the bottom of the desk. So there are the lights you can see. Kind of weird when you can look right at them, but they go all the way around the desk. And at night, we will be able to have the room kind of lit up blue. Now we're gonna move on to this Govi corner lamp. Guys, I got one last thing. This is a box LED light on a mount right here, so I have some light on me when I'm doing live streams. Okay, 
Okay, so we are all set up. I got that light set up, but I have to use my phone to turn it on. So I'm gonna try to find a way to mount it up here so that I can have it on me while I'm doing live streams. So what should happen, guys, we should be able to just put the laptop up here, connect the USB-C. Never used a monitor, so I'm not sure what all I'm gonna have to do to get it to come on, but that should be it. Yep, we got some color on our keyboard. Boom, oh my goodness. Can't find my mouse, there it is. So the coolest thing guys, I'm gonna be able to take my editing software and spread it out all the way across this monitor and have so much room. I'm gonna show you guys, I'm just gonna pull up the latest video I was working on. So this is the video I was working on and you guys can't really see, I'll zoom in a little bit on this, but everything is jam packed on the screen. And if I wanna to go to change some color effects, I have to go to a different tab or add effects, but I'm gonna be able to put all of that on one screen over here and be able to edit and do everything all at once on this big screen. Also guys, I'm wanting to do more live streams, so you guys stay tuned for that. I'm gonna set the light up. I'm gonna be able to sit here and do live streams with you guys, get a camera set up as well. And I'll be able to sit here and nice set up, got my light behind me. We'll mess with that later. I have to connect it to the phone app so I can change the colors. But we'll have the color over there behind us, some color on the desk, and then we'll have a light on us so we can do live streams. But guys, I'm pretty stoked about this setup. It's pretty tight. My guy Dre has the same monitor. So I knew I wanted a bigger monitor. I was gonna get a small one originally, but the big curved one is looking sweet. I will edit this video on here and let you guys know in the next video how this setup worked out. Now we'll go ahead and check out the rest of the house, guys. We'll come back up here at nighttime. I got a couple cool light things to show you guys. I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the house, then we'll get to that. So again, guys, we're still moving, so don't mind this. This is kind of a landing area upstairs. I'm gonna watch some TV, have some books, a little uh, lounge, a little couch. My son's playroom for now, so. He's got a nice view. He loves trucks and cars right now, so he loves to look out the window and look at the trucks. This is basically just gonna be his playroom until he gets a big, big boy bed. You got one bathroom upstairs. You guys have seen the house if you watch this. This is basically his bathroom, so. Cars, 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 that's all he wants to see. And then this is his nursery. So when we have another baby, guys, we're gonna decorate the nursery. This is where he is for now. But when he gets a big bed, we're gonna get him a car bed probably and move him back in there. So that's it. Again, guys, don't mind the mess. This is our room. I still have to mount this mirror up above the dresser and I have to mount that TV up here. So still working on that. We are moved in, guys. Tons of clothes. Nice tile shower. We've been loving it. A little bit tight in here with my wife sharing the bathroom, but master bedroom is tight. You can look out to the lake. You guys see we got some visitors today. I know you guys like that dirt yard, but we're getting in here, guys. We got most of our stuff moved in. Still putting some stuff away. That is the upstairs. We had to put these gates in. My son fell down the stairs the other day, so that was fun, but let's go down here and check it out. There's the Roomba, Theo's best friend. All right, guys, so if you watched the other video, you've seen it, but this is our entryway. We got this done. My dad came and did this. I still have to do the trimming paint. Just wanted to spice up the entryway a little bit. I uh, got a little bench to take your shoes off. We're gonna have some hooks on here to hang coats. Had to tint this front window because it is so bright with the sun coming in. But there's our front entrance, a couple closets for storage, but here's the living room. Guys, that's the box all that computer stuff came in. Biggest Amazon box I've ever seen, but again, he's been in here playing, so don't pay attention to that. But big screen TV, guys, I have some Govi lights on there that change. I'm gonna show you guys later we're waiting on our blinds so it gets super bright in here about four or five o'clock about dinner time but well, we got the couch in here we've been lounging nice big shelf over here I put together wife like that that was in the model home before we built this this is our new kitchen table that i bought guys and i took one of the benches and made a console table so you guys can sit here we have like 10 seats on the couch and then we can sit here and watch tv as well i'm thinking we're going to do a super bowl party so then we got this big kitchen table we still have to get some dining room chairs so i'm looking for some black chairs you guys see the sweet chairs we have right now and then here's the kitchen, so nice granite, nice new appliances. We're loving the ice maker. We haven't had an ice maker. We got that now. Brand new stove, microwave, dishwasher, and a nice view for uh, when she's doing the dishes. Ah. And you guys can see out back. We'll go ahead and go out back. We might hang a porch swing out here. I guess it's not a porch swing, but a deck swing. So again, guys, we're supposed to get grass any day now, but uh, for now it's dirt. My neighbor has grass, he's been watering it, and now we have mud. But there you go, guys, there is the lake. We are loving the view, just sitting out back and being able to look out there, and the sun sets over there. So I'll show you guys that later, but super nice. I don't know if we would've liked this as much if we didn't get the lake. That is about it for the downstairs. Guys, we got a laundry room right here. We did get a new washer and dryer, super nice. And then a little guest bathroom or a little washroom, what do they call it, I can't remember. Powder room, just a small bathroom downstairs. So I'm gonna head back upstairs. You guys can see we have plenty of room. We still have to move in a little bit and we are going to keep unpacking. We got some stuff to purchase still, but we are more or less all the way in. 
All right guys, so I know this video isn't gonna get a ton of views and if you're watching this, then you're somebody that just really messes with me. So I wanna tell you guys, sorry I'm out of breath, I just came up the stairs, they are wearing me out. But I wanna tell you guys, I really appreciate you guys. Those of you who really watch all my videos and care about this kind of content, I wanna see how I'm doing. I know a lot of you guys commented on the house video I did before and let me know, you know, stoked for me that I worked so hard and that it's paid off and now I have this nice house. So guys, honestly, I sit here at night sometimes and just kind of trip out that I'm in a house like this. I definitely never grew up in a house like this. Got a sweet office and all because of you guys and YouTube and all the things that I do with cutting hair. I never would have thought that a pair of clippers could get me to where I'm at today. So super crazy guys. I'm working in the shop two days a week. So YouTube is my full-time job. I go to the shop two days a week. It's kind of running itself. Now I get to sit in this cool office, work on my new computer, my new desk setup and make videos for you guys and make other types of content for the academy and things like that. And I just never would have envisioned that this is where we would be. So I'm super grateful. Appreciate all you guys that watch all of my videos. I know some of you guys really rock with me and watch every single video. So you don't know how much I appreciate it, guys. I know I got a 50 something thousand subscribers right now, and a lot of them don't care about all the content, just the stuff that pertains to them, and that's cool. But those of you who watch everything, I really appreciate it. Maybe you watch my wedding video, you guys have seen my house, and so it's a little more personal. I really appreciate you guys taking the time to keep up with what I'm doing and also learn how to cut hair and further yourself in your barber career. So hopefully one day you guys all can have the house that you dreamed of, have a nice setup, whatever it is that you guys want to do, you guys can do it with cutting hair. You guys can take this as far as you want. Some of my favorite things about it, and that's what I tell people, is you guys can take this absolutely as far as you want and there's really no limits so guys I'm gonna keep pushing we're not gonna move anytime soon but I'm gonna keep pushing forward kind of have everything I want right now I would like to get in a new car if you guys don't know I sold the BMW to get this house so I am gonna probably look for a new car sometime soon but really I'm super grateful guys I have an excellent life I work two days a week awesome family I'm having an awesome time staying home with my son and hanging out with him and I get to kind of work whenever I want up in this sweet office I guess we're gonna give it a little bit when it gets dark I'm gonna show you guys the lights downstairs we're gonna come back up here and check out these lights in the nighttime all right, guys, there's the sunset I was talking about every night. Super nice out the back window. You know, I thought he was going to come out, but he's not in the mood. He's watching his favorite movie. Let's check out those TV lights I was talking about. They change with the scene, whatever's going on. All right, guys, I want to show you one of my favorite things I added. On our way up to the office, kind of dark. You guys can see motion LEDs going up the stairs. All right guys, so I figured everything out. I got this light set up in front of me. I have to find a mount for it because it's just sitting on my other mount or my other tripod that I use for my camera. So I'm gonna have to have that, but I'm gonna get a mount that clamps to the back of the desk to put that on. You guys will see, I got the monitor set up. This thing is crazy. So here it is guys, you can see the keyboard. I think I can customize it. So I'm probably gonna change some of that. I don't necessarily want it doing rainbow flash and strobing all the time, but here's the monitor. I wanna show you guys, you saw earlier how Premiere looked on my phone. Check this out guys, when I open this up, I'm gonna take a second, open my project. And you guys see, I can double click this and make it take up the whole screen. So I'm gonna be able to put my timeline down here, my video up here. I have to mess with it for a little bit, but you guys can see absolutely game changing compared to what I had before. So you guys can see this is the setup, a little bit dark in here. I do have lights up here and I put a dimmer switch on, but you can see with the switch all the way down, it's all the way up. So I'm gonna have to tweak that dimmer switch. You guys can see pretty tight setup. Got the lights underneath the desk. We'll keep the door shut when I'm streaming. You guys see we got the blue light on the wall. It's really supposed to be in the corner. I don't know, we'll see. See what we're gonna do with it. I wanna make sure I get maximum blue. And you guys on here, it really looks like just a beam, but in the room, it's actually really a glow. You guys can see this is my shipping station. So this is my old computer. There's my enhancement cards and the finger razors. If you guys haven't seen them, I do have these finger feather razors in stock right now. And then the setup guys. And if, you know, any of the homies ever come stay with me, I got a spare bed. So I'm gonna get on here and edit this video for you guys and get it out as soon as possible. But if you guys like to do me a favor, smash that thumbs up. Like I said, those of you who are watching this video, I know you really mess with me. So I really appreciate it. I wanna make sure you guys know that. If you guys aren't subscribed and you did watch this video, go ahead and hit that button guys. I got this new setup. I'm gonna be doing some crazy stuff in here. Let me comment down below and let me know what your favorite thing is of this setup or if you got any other suggestions of stuff I need to do. As always guys, I appreciate each and every one of you that watches my channel, watches all my videos. I appreciate it. I'll catch you guys next time.